Hi, in this video we're going to show you a free tool you could use to clean up temporary files and other items on your PC. It's called Clean Manager. So once you download it and extract the zip file, you just run the executable so there's nothing to install. All right, so once you run it, you'll have two options here. So this one, just Clean Manager. This will run an improved and open source version of Classic Disk Cleanup Utility. So you just click it, pick your C drive, and then click OK. But we're going to do the other method here, so the Clean Manager Plus, uh, because this gives you a lot more flexibility and options. Okay, so when you open it here, it's broken down into two tabs uh, with some categories here on the left. All right, so we have the Clean Manager tab, so this will show you mostly Windows components that you could clean up. So if you click on something, for example, you could click on Preview to see what it's going to do. So 110 files, 49 megabytes. Then it tells you at the bottom here what this option does. Same if you click on Recycle Bin, preview that. 19 files, 88 megabytes. And if you check two of them, you can preview that. And it'll just list them together. Okay, let's go to the More tab here. All right, you have some options for your web browsers. So even if you don't have the browser installed, there'll still be an option. So if we click on Chrome, for example, because Chrome is installed here, preview, you can see what it's going to do. But if we click on Opera, which is not installed, you're not going to get any options there. And then you have some other options here. If you want to clear out your event viewer logs, it's not going to show you anything because it's just cleaning out the logs, not deleting files. Installer cache, All right, nothing there. Shadow copies, so watch what happens when you click on shadow copies. And preview. You don't have the correct permissions for this command, and that is because we didn't run it as administrator. So that's another option if you want to make sure you could delete everything. It's just to right click on it, run as administrator. All right, so now when we run it, it just tells us no items were found to satisfy that query. So at least it ran that time. We have some Windows update logs, 40 files. Okay, so let's pick a few things here. We'll do some of these Windows cache files here. And then watch what happens if you click the downloads folder. It's warning you that it's gonna delete your downloads folder on your computer. So I'm gonna actually skip that one. Okay, let's do that. Let's see what we got here. All right, now let's go over to the Clean Manager tab as well. Let's do Temporary Files, Delivery Optimization Files, and Windows Update Cleanup. Now if we click on Preview, Gives us a listing of everything it's going to do here. Okay, so we have items from both tabs selected here. Now, also, if you click on select, you could select all, none, or just the recommended. And if you click on the gain section here, it will give you a breakdown of how much space you'll get back and how many files from there. And also, you might have noticed this plus button here to import a cleanup rule or add a custom job. So if you have a script, you could do that. Then you could create a custom job like that if you want to look into how you could do that. Okay, so now we're ready to go here. Let's click on Clean Up. Say yes. Okay, so the job is done here. So it looks like it freed up about 1.4 gigabytes there. 
and it tells you everything it did here, which is nice. And that's pretty much all there is to it. All right, so I will put a link in the description where you can download Clean Manager, and then you can try it out for yourself. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe. Thank mm -hmm. you.